Well, Michael Linton, uh, coach of the Canterbury team here at the women's tournament. Uh, Michael, great day for Canterbury, couple of wins, couple more wins than you've had over previous years. Yeah, definitely. So, um, yeah, it's been, uh, this is my third year with the team and today's the first time I've had a win with the squad. Uh, we've got girls in, in the team who have been here for the last two campaigns as well and I think they're, they're just buzzing on the fact that we've been able to come up, build a, build a good squad. Um, and yeah, sort of set our goals and we've achieved goals for our day one. So just just really hearting and the buzz in the room is pretty cool. And I think that they feel that you know we're on the right track. So you've had uh, wins today over the Seafall Vipers and uh, Akarana, uh, sorry, the Auckland Vulcans. Yep. Um, how do, how do you think the team went in those two performances? I think we we definitely stuck to our plan. We stuck to our structures, played to our strengths, and. Um, yeah, that, that, that's what we pulled off in the end. Um, I think the real feature for us, uh, uh, defensive intensity, that, that, that's what got us there in the end. We were, were turning up for each other. Um, we only let in three tries over those two games, um, whereas in the past, our defence has probably been uh, definitely a weak point. So, um, yeah, they stuck to their structures and really worked for each other, which was the biggest aspect for me, um, seeing them do that. And at the same time, you ran in a few tries. A couple of the girls in your team uh, ran in a uh, hat-trick of tries today. Yeah, so yeah, a few of our outside backs getting on the score sheet a few times, and I think um, you know just club combinations are really helpful in, in picking the squad. I suppose I, I tried to play to that as well. So we only have a limited build-up, so if I can work in club combinations, that um, yeah, it's all, all good for the squad and the uh, the greater the greater tournament. So um, and, it, and it's pulled off today. So um, yeah, I think they're, they're definitely excited about tomorrow. Third game of the day was against Counties Manukau, and they're a pretty formidable team. Uh, how did you think you, you guys went against them? I think oh, they're always going to be a, a good challenge, um, a good barometer of where you're at in terms of how your preparations are going. And I think it showed we've definitely got you know, some work to do. And I think um, the girls will go back and reflect tonight on what worked and what didn't work. And I think we've had some good moments there against, against counties, but um, their just polish was is just uh, second to none. And you can't just give them any chances. And our errors definitely didn't help. I think that's what sort of gave them the score in the end so yeah but looking forward to tomorrow i guess after today you've kind of earned yourself the dark horse uh team of the tournament uh, uh, but you come up against the Corona falcons tomorrow that's probably going to decide the the other finalists i guess yeah oh that's yeah that's a key game for us i guess coming in we had some goals and um yeah we've achieved our day one goal so now it's day two we've got new goals for tomorrow and yeah Corona's part of that but mate this is footy and uh we'll just go there and give it a crack really play some footy and see what happens Michael, uh, congratulations on your day today and uh, good luck tomorrow. No worries, thanks Grant and uh, cheers mate, we'll catch you then.